everybody. One last time, thank you to Dave Eggers and to President Barack Obama. And how about uh, a little recognition for this amazing woman? Give it up for Najeeb. Thank you. Thank you all so much. It has been an honor and a pleasure. Thank you. Uh, Najeeb has his wonderful ability to make things look super easy. I also want to recognize and have everybody here recognize anyone who stood on this stage over the course of the past two days and shared your story. Stand up so that people around you can see it. It's been an incredible two days, hasn't it, David? Uh, it, uh, it so has been an amazing couple of days. And there are a couple of other groups of people that we need to appropriately recognize. First, to everyone who is here, who participated, who was vulnerable, who shared your story, and who is part of the Obama network, please give yourselves a big round of applause. To all of the members of the Obama Foundation team and staff and interns, thank you for your work. And while we have had a very intimate small group here in Chicago, I want to thank the tens of thousands of people who have joined us to watch online via live stream. Thank you for joining us here in Chicago. And I think we could all agree that so much has happened off the main stage as well. As Dave called it, there have been sparks left and right. And so we hope so many of the connections that have been formed and the friendships that have begun will continue so that those collaborations can help us make all of our communities that much better. And so to Najin and to the rest of us, before we part here in this space, I want everybody to take in the person next to you, the people who are part of your communities here, the stories that you have exchanged, the vulnerability that you have shown, the strength and the commitment that you have launched, all of you today are part of this Obama network. And as you go forward to do the work that you're gonna to continue to do, I want you to be mindful of the lessons that you have learned today, of the common hopes and the uncommon stories, and I want you to root your work in some words of the 44th President of the United States and remember them deeply. Change doesn't happen if we wait for some other person or for some other time. We are the ones we have been waiting for. We are the change that we seek. All of you have a responsibility to make those words come true. So let's get to work and I'll see everybody next year. Thanks, everybody.